Hello, uh, today we've got with us a new phone from Videocon. It's called Cruise with a Q. Right there. As you can see, this phone is uh, a bit different from the regular candy bar phones that we get from Videocon. It's got a very angular body. Yeah. And it's slightly reminiscent of uh, the Nokia Prism phone that we had seen some years back. As you can see, the body is very clean and it doesn't have any buttons on the side which may be annoying for some of you who are used to the volume rocker on the side. Uh, it's got a 3.5mm audio jack and a flashlight torch which is a regular feature in the dual SIM entry phones nowadays. The main feature of this phone is the 100W PMPO output speaker. Now let's get into the user interface. Uh, like all the low entry dual sim phones this also has a standard java user interface but one thing we noticed was uh, it's got very vibrant uh, wallpapers and backgrounds which makes it very attractive the home screen has your standard nine menus like organizer file manager phone book etc we found two interesting things in this phone known as sms backup and contact backup which you generally don't expect on such low end phones the camera quality is not that great because we have a 0.3 megapixel VGA camera. So don't expect great photographs and videos. This phone bundles along a, a, set, a pair of earphones which are of really poor quality and we didn't really find the experience of listening audio on this very good. You definitely don't want these earphones on when you are receiving a call or you know answering a call so that's it about the phone it's priced at around 3200 rupees which we feel is quite a decent price for such a phone and now let's have a listen into the music like we said it's loud. it's really 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 loud feels good. So that's it from Digit. Hope you like the review. Bye bye.